Hi there, I want to give you some preview and a demonstration of how to use a site builder a little bit more. So if you're currently not on site builder and you're wondering why would you even consider switching to site builder? Well, uh, there are main uh, three main advantages of switching to site builder. One, the, uh, the new site builder themes, there's Vogue and those are Empire. And these two themes offer a little bit more creative and more uh, custom look without having to customize uh, your uh, site uh, code at all. The benefit of the theme is that it's already uh, built within the existing uh, drag and drop um, frame. So everything is very easy to change and modify without having to do any coding. And this is important because if you know a little bit of code and you know how it works, but you're not great about coding, uh, you don't need to know any code at all and you can just easily change the look with a click of a button. So right now I've chosen the build my site uh, to build my site in the Vogue theme. So if I wanted to continue doing this, I would click on build my site. And here I see so many different options to build my site. And I've gone through some of the settings, um, theme settings, which will allow you to change the styles and the colors. And remember, this is really easy. All you have to do is click this icon and you can apply different looks and styles to your course. Now, if you want to go and focus on building uh, the content of your page, we could definitely do that with um, each arrow. And just keep in mind that each arrow is really how you navigate and to keep that in mind to know where to click because that will really save you a lot of frustration really clicking on the wrong button that the arrows will really take you to what uh, your goals are here. So I'm going to click on home page and see the all my options here with my banner, social proof, image and text with call to action, uh, my product section, um, just a call to action and bonus material. So as you can see, everything is just kind of stackable in sections and it sort of uh, can be displayed in different ways. Now, I like the advantage of Site Builder here because it gives me more options for my landing page. Uh, landing page is the first uh, page that people see when they stumble upon and land on your website or homepage. And right now I don't really have a lot going on because I'm kind of in the early stages of building this. So, but if I wanted to sort of, you know, as I'm exploring this and, you know, showing people what I can do, I want to sort of put some kind of design and kind of text to it and really set a good foundation and first impression for people who are learning from me and coming to learn about my course. So in the banner section, I'm going to change um, the heading. Right now it says banner, but I really want to change it to say, um, welcome. That's like a typical thing. And then I want to give it a subheading because, well, what is this website about? And I want to say, uh, my site will teach you all about building your first online course. And that subheader will sort of make it very clear and kind of very laid out nicely and easy to read text, not a lot of text, but enough text to sort of give the reader a good grasp and a good kind of like overview of what I'm about. And this is important because when they first land on your page, they don't have a lot of time. So if you don't catch their attention quickly, they're going to, you're going to lose them and you're not going to be able to capture an audience that way. So uh, by doing this, I'm going to give uh, people a quick overview when they see this, that I'm teaching you all about building your first online course. And then I can say, well, this kind of color, I don't know if that really works right now, but let me just kind of explore different colors. And let's just say I wanna explore something more colorful instead of neutral, then I can go with like this like teal green. I can also go with this orangey brownish color and play with around with it. But I think right now the white really kind of matches uh, the neutral background banner image really well. And that's something to consider when you're um, designing your landing pages. Do the colors really blend well? You know, what's the optimal, you know, matching and branding? Um, that is not my expertise, but you can definitely go and find that information online about what colors mean, what the 
significance of colors are and which colors blend well together. So now I've given people a little overview of what my site is about. If I want, I could also change the image. Um, right now you see it's these circles and sort of lines. And if I want, I can easily just remove this image if I want or upload a new image based on the existing dimensions. And if I also want, I can customize um, the site uh, alignment of my text. So right now it's large and left, but I can also customize this to center. And so maybe I think that's what I like right now. And you know, I think that's you know a good sort of introduction. And I'm going to save it. And those are all my changes for my first um, uh, header section in the banner. Now, I, there's some other stuff that I haven't changed, which is the social proof and logos. So this is the section where I can add different logos. So I can say course creators logo and it'll show up um, once I add my logo image here. But the idea is I can continue to add different titles and texts as more logos. Yeah. So as you see, I don't really have many images, but if I did, I could just uh, remove it or upload a new one. And then if I like the changes, I'm gonna go ahead and click save. And now these changes have been saved. The idea is that every logo that goes under this section uh, will be displayed with this alternate text. Uh, the idea is that when someone hovers over the image, they will see this is all about my course creators logo. And the reason why this is advantageous is because when someone is searching um, in Google for a specific um, keyword or image that um, course creators uh, will sort of also take them to my site. So uh, that's an overview on social proof. And the idea is that I can sort of add different logos and banner images um, of sort of testimonials that sort of demonstrate that I, you know, can teach you how to build your first online course. Now, what's also important to my landing page is having some images. And this is really crucial because I like that uh, the previous landing page didn't give me as much options for text and images with call to action. And right now you're probably wondering, well, I want a video kind of uh, in here in that you can do that too. Um, but let me just show you how to do the text. And so here is image and text with call to action. And I can just say uh, image call to action. And when I do that, you'll see that um, I'm setting up the header for my image below this. And then I can say, this is another call to action. And then on the bottom, I can describe what that means. And I can continue doing that for more images if I feel like I need more to convey the testimonial and reasons why uh, one would wanna buy my online course. And then I can even customize the buttons and to choose what kind of buttons I like on different pages. So right now you can see I can kind of customize um, all these different looks based on um, uh, for each course. So this is, says call to action, but I could say sign up now. And you will see that I have changed this to sign up now for my um, landing page on this course. And just so you know, this uh, button can be customized uh, for different links. So they've given these are all my kind of current courses within Thinkific. And so if I want to change the button to say sign up now, I can uh, cross reference that to another course page. And so then it will say once it changes to sign up now as well onto that other site. So as you see, this is just sort of ways to play around with it. And I hope this was helpful. If you have a question or more comments about how else you can use Site Builder theme, uh, let me know. Uh, check out Thinkific. We're giving away a month free on the business plan and the business plan promotion 
uh, for a month includes a one-on-one -on -one call uh, with an account manager to help you onboard and set up your course. It includes uh, other bonuses and goodies in terms of having a customer representative and customer support person dedicated to your online course. So if you're interested in learning more about Thinkific Site Builder, leave a comment, leave a question, and I look forward to uh, answering any questions. Thanks.